Medieval Europe had all kinds of problems with sanitation and hygiene. Beer presented a safe alternative to people who might be tempted to drink from the river. Before the dawn of civilization, humans learned to control fire and the technology could clear forests, frighten predators, and cook. Grilling meat removed harmful bacteria from that protein source, and boiled soups were more nutritious and they did not make you sick. The nearby stream, in contrast, might have you retching and miserable. Ancient Egyptians and Sumerians did not have microscopes but they did understand the dangers of drinking water from lakes and rivers contaminated with human and animal waste. Even fresh water stored in barrels eventually developed colonies of bacteria, algae, and other microorganisms if let to sit for too long. So the ancients dug wells to reach clean fresh water below the ground. The Romans famously built aqueducts to transport fresh spring water from faraway places to urban centers. Drinking from the Tiber River was not an option. Wine, the preferred beverage of Roman elites, was safe to drink, but in other parts of the empire, in places such as Germany and England, the people could not grow vines so easily, and they preferred beer. Brewing involved boiling the water to extract fermentable sugars from the barley malt, which purified the water and turned the beer alcoholic. Alcohol is not only intoxicating, it is antimicrobial, just like the acids in hops, beer's companion since the Middle Ages. So why didn't ancient people just boil their water as a precaution? Well, if you're going to boil your water to avoid cholera or dysentery, you might as well brew some beer. Cholera is a waterborne illness that plagued the pre-modern world. Here are a few illustrations showing cholera's devastating impact and its great carrier through Lower England, River Thames. Thank goodness for microscopes, water treatment plants, and public health policy. Tap water is safe for the most part, but if you invent a time machine and go back a few millennia, or even to towns in the Old West, you would be wise to reach for beer or whiskey. Avoid water from the barrels. This has been a beer story, and thanks for watching.